హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు రెన్ విల్ ఎడ్యుకేట్ ఛానల్ ఇన్ దిస్ వీడియో లెట్ అస్ లర్న్ హౌ టు డిజైన్ అ సింపుల్ క్యాల్కులేటర్ యూజింగ్ విబిఏ యూజర్ ఫామ్ ఫ్రెండ్స్ బిఫోర్ మూవింగ్ టు దిస్ వీడియో ఐ రిక్వెస్ట్ యూ టు సబ్స్క్రైబ్ మై యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ రెన్ విల్ ఎడ్యుకేట్ లైక్ మై వీడియోస్ and share my videos with your friends friends i have a simple and blank excel sheet in front of me now i have to generate or design a simple calculator with the help of excel you can do maybe by just mentioning text 1 text 2 and giving some formula or minus division subtraction all these formulas you can give and you can design that way but we have macro vba code which will help us to design a simple calculator so as i told you earlier you in order to get this develop a tab you have to go to file you have to go to options you have to go to custom ribbon and you have to select this developer tab okay now in developer tab we have insert column this sorry insert tool insert controls these insert controls you have label text atvex controls you have command button in form controls and there is atvex controls but today i am going to use command button from the atvex control okay and i will go to properties and i will give name as generate user form okay now so here go to caption go to properties and here generate or you can say how to click here to get user form okay uh there is some problem here uh anyway this text is not going to change i will edit here itself generate user form okay now double click one code we be a code window will open so here you will write a simple code that is user form one dot show okay this is simple code in sheet 1 now there is this work book under this work book either you can go to insert and click user form or right click insert user form so one user form is appeared here now this toolbox is applicable only for the user form 
Now, first I want to enter one label. Similarly, I want two more labels. Okay. Label 1, label 2, label 3. And go to right click properties. Okay. So, here if you see the left is 0. I will make it to 2. Okay. If you can still, you can make it to 5. That is left aligned. Okay. Next, if you want to change the font color, there is here. This is the background color. You can change background color in this way. And I will change to font color that is here. You can make it to white. Okay. And the text alignment, maybe you can make it to center. And maybe you can change the font size. You can go to bold, then okay. Okay. Now. You have to change the caption. To change the caption, select that user form and come here caption 1. That is, enter first first number second Enter second number and third is result. Okay. Now you design the three labels. Now you have to design three text box. The text box is to enter the data from the user so this is the text box I will design here okay I'll shift little this side then three more text box I want okay See, if you select this text box, you can see the name of that text box. The text box 3, text box 2 and text box 1. Okay. Now, I will select all this, this text box and I will select the font color bold and font size I will make 14. Okay. Then, remaining, I don't think I need to change the any properties. Uh, since uh, it's in uh, background color is white and font color is black and already size has changed so no need to change anything now these are the labels these are the text box next what I want is command buttons command buttons just to what calculator what the what type of calculation I want Maybe addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, whatever. So I here I will design the four command buttons. That is addition, subtraction, multiplication and uh, division. So we have command button over here. So one command button. Two command buttons. Sorry, one command button, two command button, third command button, and fourth command button, and the last command button. Maybe you can design many more. It depends on your requirement. Okay, 
so this command buttons what i will do go to uh, times new roman bold 10 okay next uh, maybe you can if you want font color also you can change i will make this color okay so now you have to change the caption name edition subtraction go to caption and change subtraction then multiplication and division and last is exit maybe you can change the background color over here I'll change to black and font color to maybe yellow so you can change okay just to differentiate background color okay now you designed your form you have to write the code okay so to write the code you have to double click each command button so because you have to assign that code assign that macro against each button so i'll double click edition so what i will write where i need to get the result in text box text box 3 text box 3 value equal value text box 1 dot value close the bracket plus value text box 2 dot value close the bracket okay this is the simple code text box 3 dot value equal value text box 1 dot value plus value text box 2 dot value okay this is the simple code you will write this text code I'll copy I'll go to double click and I will just change the sign okay then multiplication then subtraction okay so this four command I assign the code now the last code last uh, command button is left that is exit so exit what I will mention unload user form 1 unload means close user form 1 and I will close ok so now I have written the code I have designed the calculator and I want to go back to the excel so now you have to go to design mode and just click the generate form or you can do either that way or you can go to macro there is already code and go to VBA so you can go to uh, go to macro
code is macro is not assigned that's why we are getting this error okay so now let me still there is problem let me go back Uh, not sure why the macro is not assigned this workbook yes see now is perfectly running so now you have generate user form command click generate user form okay your user form is appearing so enter first number whichever number you want enter second number whichever number you want and the result you have to click any command button over here if you click addition you can see 67 plus 4 if you click subtraction you can see 63 that is 67 minus 4 if you multiply if you multiply so there's something wrong happened here. So 67 plus 4, so 67 multiplying to 4 should be, if you click division, so exactly answer is coming. So yes, subtraction, this is not change. So same subtraction uh, is uh, showing here. So click exit to unload the form. So I will just go to code. I'll go to multiplication and I will change command for this uh, star okay and i will save okay now go to excel generate and see 10 and 3 and multiplication is 30 division is 3.33 subtraction is 7 addition is 13 exit and this is how you will design a simple calculator and you will calculate the values this will help you in many ways to save your time and also it is kind of learning more and more learning in excel uh, maybe you can have few more formulas here so that your calculator become more uh, helpful to you to your to increase your efficiency we can say friends Thank you for watching this small video. If you like this video, kindly write a nice comment below the video. Like, share this video to your friends. And if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel, Renville Educate. Thank you once again.